week between Christmas and New Year is usually a slow one. School and businesses in home and out take a break. Many of us take time off and we find ourselves eating big meals, snacking more and sitting around at home. But come December 31st, we'll be making all kinds of resolutions to work out more, eat less, save money and do better. Mom on the run Colleen Byrne says this is a great time to get off the couch and out of the house to get a little fresh air and kickstart those New Year's resolutions. And Colleen is with us now. Colleen, what can we do to kickstart a healthy new year? Well, here's an idea. You can actually save more than $1,000 a year just by meeting specific activity goals. And it's easier to keep track of that activity with the new Apple Fitness Plus. It just dropped this month. And starting January 1st, if you're a member of United Healthcare's Motion Wellbeing Program, programming for at least six months at no additional charge. It's powered by Apple Watch. You've got access to 10 different workout types from um, strength training to yoga to cycling. And it's powered by some of the top music from the top music artists in the world. And it's also led by some of the world's best trainers. Another great goal this year is to drink more water. I think we're all a little stressed over the holidays and water helps with that. Um, Fiji is my favorite water because of the smooth taste. It's the easiest water for me to drink because of the naturally occurring electrolytes, twice the electrolytes of top premium bottled water brands, um, for instance. And they've got a great sports cap bottle that's really easy to take with on workout and when I'm running errands. They also have a home delivery subscription, which is really slick. You can give this to somebody you love or give it to yourself. We're all trying to practice a little extra self-care right now. You know, 2020 was a year like no other. So what makes New Year's resolutions especially relevant right now? Well, you know, we've all been streaming TV a little more than we used to, right? And so that's a great area to think about saving some money. Talk about, you know, cutting your cable subscriptions and all that equipment you had to rent and try Roku TV instead. I love it because there are hundreds of free channels, whether you're watching a movie or TV or listening to music or watching sports. Um, and now you can give the gift of sound with their new stream bar. It's really compact, but inside there are four multi-directional speakers. So no matter what size your room is, it'll fill it up with rich Dolby sound. And another way to save money this new year, which is so important, is SoFi Money. It's a cash management account. And they have this vaults feature where they separate your spending from your savings and they also have a new roundup feature that actually will round up your transactions to the nearest dollar and then automatically deposit it into your savings vault and so you're saving while you're spending which is kind of brilliant and speaking of brilliant Suunto has a new watch and I love it because it's a mashup of a Herculean sports watch with the features of a smart watch. It's the Suunto 7. I love the large display, but my favorite feature is the free offline maps of trails all over the world. The watch automatically loads local maps while it's charging and connected to Wi-Fi, records your heart rate, pace, training, and any of 70 sports like running or hiking, even ping pong, while still alerting me with emails and text messages. So the map function is really a great idea if you're traveling or if you're just trying to explore different trails near your home. I think we've all explored as many trails as we can possibly think of at this point. And as a mom, you're pretty busy. So what are some other tips that you can share with our viewers? Well, I would just again mention self-care. I think we all need to do more of that, especially moms. We take care of other people so much. But once you're back up to speed, make sure that you remember that not everyone is up to speed. And, you know, a lot of people are hurting out there. So if you can, volunteer and get your kids to help you. Mom on the run, Colleen Burns with us today. Colleen, thank you so much.